What's up, Set King? Stefan here from Sacred. Today, we are going to test PUBG out on the new Google Pixel 3a. Stay tuned. everyone so a lot of people saw my fortnite gameplay and a lot of people said they don't play fortnite on mobile they'd rather see pubg so in this video i'm going to be playing pubg right now we're going to be seeing how it runs with four gigabytes of ram the 670 snapdragon processor and we're basically just going to check what graphics this can run on and see if it runs smoothly and it's playable all right everyone so the graphics that put me on were high and hd we can't go any higher than that i'm pretty sure that's the highest you can go on most mobile devices i believe you can use hdr if you have an hdr screen like on the Galaxy Note 9 or the S10 Plus, but this is going to be set on HD high and it's going to be set on the regular classic settings. But yeah, guys, tell me how you think this is going to run in the comments down below before we even start the game. In my opinion, I think this game is going to run just fine on the Snapdragon 670, but yeah, I definitely want to hear your opinions in the comments down below. All right, so we're just running around right here. Um, honestly, the graphics look really good so far. I don't see any hiccups as of yet. Even the shadowing looks really nice right here. As you guys see, the plane wing is right there, and we can see the shadow of it. Graphics look really, really nice though. And again, you can go ahead and change the filters to make it look more realistic and everything, but looks really, really good. Also, the other thing about this is we do have stereo speakers. So these are gonna be some pretty decent speakers when playing video games. I know I talked about that before when I was playing Fortnite, but you guys are gonna have some pretty decent stereo speakers on this device. But let's see how this game plays right now. Let's go ahead and jump off. Everything seems to be decent so far, honestly, on HD graphics, um, on classic mode, everything seems to be running decently. Um, but let's see how many kills we can get. We're probably not going to try to get a chicken dinner or a win or whatever. Um, but let's see how this game runs. Also, if you guys haven't checked out that Fortnite video already, definitely go ahead and check it out. Honestly, it wasn't playable for me, but some of you said you guys can play on that. I do not know how you guys can play on that. You must be experts at it. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and test this out and see how we can play on this. So we have two shotguns right off the bat. That's funny. Uh, we got a vest already, though, so that's cool. Flare gun. Let's go ahead and run around. Uh, try to find a semi-automatic gun or maybe an assault rifle, if possible, uh, and get this whole thing started. It sounds really, really good, though, when I shoot the shotgun. The speaker sounds really good. The stereo speakers. Obviously, this is not showing any justice to the phone uh, when you're hearing it through a screen, but it sounds good nonetheless. Let's go ahead and find... Hmm. What gun do we want? Let's get this gun right here. Oh, oh, oh. So we're getting a hit right now. All right here. There we go. One kill. Everything's been running very, very smoothly so far, though. Let's go and take these up. Let's go and switch that out. All right, guys. So we're on one kill. Um, the temperature of the phone isn't hot whatsoever. doesn't feel hot. I was playing Fortnite on this phone, and it did get hot instantly. Uh, but playing PUBG, it seems to be running super, super good. And I'm not getting any heating issues on this as of yet. I'm going to be staying optimistic, though. Um, I'm pretty sure we're not going to be getting any heating issues, especially since we're probably only going to play this for 5 to 10 minutes. Uh, but so far, it's been running decently. We're going to try to find a vehicle, try to get some more kills, do some aiming in and try some other stuff to show you guys the graphics and show off PUBG on the Google Pixel 3a. Uh, oh snap. Oh wow, lost a lot of health like that. Also playing this game on the screen, uh, this is sort of a long screen. I know it's only 5.6 inches. I am playing on the regular Pixel 3a, but this is actually pretty comfortable. I didn't think it was gonna be too comfortable, especially since I have really big hands and I might make the phone look super small, uh, but this is actually super comfortable so far. Graphics look nice though. It looks like it doesn't have any problems rendering the graphics. The shadowing looks decent as well. And honestly, the range is really good as well. I can see the houses all the way out there. I know they some of them are loading in right now. But for the most part, everything looks to be loading in pretty decently. Um, especially for a Snapdragon 670 and 4GB uh, of RAM on this device. Definitely running super, super smooth though. There's a guy right here, running away, killed him, he's done, awesome. Updates, so everything seems to be running smoothly so far, the phone heat didn't go up whatsoever, so that's a really, really good sign. 
um, and everything has stayed the same within the last five ten minutes so everything looks really good so far everything's running really good and I'm feeling very optimistic about PUBG on the uh, Pixel 3a I want to go ahead and test out a vehicle though um, just to see how the graphics render how everything looks see if there's any slowdown with that because that may go ahead and actually test the uh, graphics in this game but we're gonna go ahead and find a vehicle really quick so we'll fast forward to that in a second um, if I get any kills on the way I will definitely show you alright everyone so I just found my first vehicle we're gonna see how this goes um, also through a Molotov cocktail bomb the graphics on that looked pretty decent actually um, we're in the vehicle now though doesn't seem to have any slowdown so far um, looks really good looks decent all the controls are very responsive I actually have someone over there shooting at some of my teammates. Let's see if I can go to rescue. Let's go ahead and exit this. He's done. Go ahead and take this stuff though. Let's see if we can aim in right here as well. Killed him. Awesome. So yeah, this game is super, super playable. Um, also, driving that car didn't heat up the phone as well. Um, none of this is heating up the phone. The phone actually feels cold, as it should be. And I'm knocked right now because a storm just came through. Um, but the graphics are holding up. Everything seems to be holding up. Everything looks good. Uh, I'm being revived by my teammate right now, but uh, everything looks decent, guys. Everything looks really, really good. Gonna try to go ahead and get out of the storm, but this runs perfectly on the Google Pixel 3a. Got another kill right there. But yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video and hopefully I showed you that PUBG does work perfectly on the Google Pixel 3a. Everything runs really good, graphics look great, even driving the vehicles doesn't have any drops in the frames. Everything looked good though, everything looked really really good. But yeah, if you guys want me to test any other game, definitely leave it in the comments down below. But hopefully you guys have a great day, also happy Mother's Day. This has been Safan from TechRite, peace out Tech Gang.